welcome back to the channel guys for another video hope you're all doing well out there happy thursday everybody it's my favorite day of the week thursday as you all probably know if you listen to the podcast yes guys it's now almost the weekend once again it's another beautiful day here in northern ireland the weather the last two, two or three days hasn't been overly great it's been sort of up and down and raining yesterday with the rain was yesterday was horrendous but it was good though it was good to get the rain because we've had a lot, a lot, lot of sunshine recently sorry and it's just nice to break it up and get that rain which was nice, thunder lightning too, which was a nightmare. But anyway, yes guys, i got some uh, footage I want to show you uh, shortly. When I come back, because I'm about to head out the door here now and take Lewis to the doctors for a regular checkup and stuff he always gets. Um, so we're heading to see the doctor, get everything checked over, make sure he's okay and whatever else he gets to check up every so often. Um, and then we're heading back home here to then make some dinner. And then tonight, I'm going to be having some beers. Chill now, it's Thursday. But anyway, um, I want to go here now, you guys, head to the doctors. I actually have to go to ours today for that. Newton ours up the road. Your dad's coming to pick us up. We're heading up there first. When I come back, I'm going to be showing you some footage from uh, last night. Lewis and I were at the first preseason game for the Welders last night in Larne, home of the Premiership Champions. Now, you all know a lot of months ago, um, it's well documented that we played Larne in the Irish Cup. And we took them right to the last minute and they beat us in the 92nd minute or something like that, whatever it was, and stopped us from getting to the semi-finals of the Irish Cup, which was a nightmare. But uh, last night, guys, it was pre-season friendly. Lauren qualified for the Champions League qualifiers, so they're preparing for the Champions League. We only started back to pre-season training on Wednesday night. Now, they've had a couple of wee sessions. Obviously, boys are not compulsory to come back, whatever, because a lot of boys are away on holiday or whatever. Uh, last night's game was more young lads for the Welders playing, like 17, 18, 19 year olds coming through. Manager wants to take a look at them. There's one or two, maybe two or three, maybe first teamers. Um, but again, they're just back from their holidays, so they're they're obviously not they're trying to work on their fitness. A lot of the first teams away on holiday at the moment, so they agreed to do a friendly with Lauren last night, the Premiership Champions, down at their ground, and we were down there last night, and it was a great night. Thank you to Lauren again for all the hospitality. Thank you to everybody who came up and said hello last night. A lot of people come up and said hello to me last night, and wanted a couple of pictures and wanted to just chat about different bits and pieces. So it was nice to meet everybody last night too as well. And I uh, saw all those lads who you saw in the vlog the other week um, when Lewis got his football award. The, they're calling themselves now the, the Welders Ultras. I saw the guys last night, so big shout out to those boys as well. I didn't actually realise they were at the game until I saw them at the end of the night when they were leaving the stadium. But anyway, yes, uh, uh, what happened was, guys, to tell you a long story short, they're, one of their media guys has been taking the trophy on a tour around the country. And to cut a long story short, I was talking to him the day before the game. And I said to him, with the trophy be at the ground? Because so, Lewis and I wanted to get a photo of it. And I, we did get a photo of it years and years ago, but Lewis and Brooke were really, really tiny. And I wanted to get it, obviously, because Lewis and I works in the Irish League, and I'd like to see a, a photograph of him holding the Premiership trophy properly. Now, he wasn't too sure if it was going to be there last night, but I spoke to one of the guys um, at Lauren after the game, and I said to him, look, listen, there's any chance we can get a photo of the trophy. And the guy who knows me, obviously, from working in football, he went upstairs and spoke to one of the, I think it was the director or one of the chairman or whatever. And I was in the middle of doing an interview last night with the manager after the game. There he turned the camera off, turned around, and there's the Premiership Trophy right beside me. So thanks to Lauren for letting Lewis and I uh, see the Premiership Trophy last night. Hold it, do a bit of video for this vlog as well. Didn't do many but lots of clips of it, just us holding it and stuff. So you'll see that after I get back from the doctor's surgery. So it was nice that, and then I got a photograph together too as well, which was great. So I'll show you that clips whenever I get back from the doctor's surgery. So better go, because dad's coming to pick us up. So better go and ready to rock and roll here. Lewis is up there now. He had a sp uh, sports thing in school today, so he's a bit knackered. So they're going to pick him up after that. And then we're heading straight to the doctor's just to get checked over and stuff like that. There he goes once a year. He's, he's grand. He's obviously grew more and he's, he's put on more weight. He's getting bigger now too as well. So just go once a year for a wee checkup and stuff. So it's all good. Right, I'll show you that tr uh, footage with the Premiership Trophy shortly. Let's head down the road here, head over to see the doctor and uh, get Lewis checked over. And we'll see you back here at the house in a couple of minutes time, guys.
Time for a doctor's check up for this one. See if he still has brains. Well, I just left the doctor's surgery and everything's doing grand. He's all good. He still has a brain. Isn't that right? Still got a brain for now. So it is. You're going to get your shower now after your sports day. Look at that day today, Lewis. Isn't that gorgeous? It's a day to be sitting there. Oh, here we go home and cut the grass. No. <laughs> What'd you drop? Oh, he's throwing his money away. There's grand that's not waiting on you. Might run over at him and give him a big spear like edge. Go on. Hold on. Go. See if he can take it. He's all good. All healthy. Fit and healthy and all good in the hood. He's still got a brain. For now, anyway, at least. Oh, the hometown at last. You've been a good son carrying the bag back in the shop. Now. <laughs> I'm not good. At it. You're young, I'm old. <laughs> Come on, now. Stop acting like a fool. Sure. We're going to get a shower now after your sports day, too, and be at the doctor's. Here. Walk past this place for a couple of days now. For a couple of months now. Look at the renovation work they're doing here, Liz. Lovely, isn't it? They've just transformed those two bungalows into. One, I think it's one or is it two? I don't, I don't know. Here, there's a skip. I'm going to put you into it. But yes, there's his trip to the doctor was successful. He still has a brain cell. For an eye, anyway, at least. Well, home at last. God, it's getting warm out there now. It is warm, trust me. Um, but yes, Lewis is all good. Thank you very much for home over the doctors. Um, I think he was born knackered after his sports day. So yeah, he's up in the shower now, so he is, so... Um, but it's all good. But anyway, yes, now that I'm home, I'm going to show you these big short clips, just a wee tiny short clip, guys, because I didn't have much time with this trophy. Um, but it was great last night just to uh, see it properly, and actually get to hold it properly instead of just going click and then walking on, you know what I mean? So, yes, last night, guys, we got to hold the Premiership trophy and get some photos and videos for you for the vlog today. So, here is the clips from Inver Park last night. Lewis and I got to see the, well, I don't even think it's called the Danske Bank Premiership anymore. I think it's called the Sports Direct Premiership now or something. They got their chain as their sponsor this year. Well, it's the Premiership trophy here in Northern Ireland for the top division in football in Northern Ireland. This is a trophy that all footballers in this country should aspire to win. That and the Irish Cup, which you've seen in this vlog before as well. Um, when I was at the Irish Cup draws and the Irish Cup final. and But this is the, the Premiership trophy last night. At Inver Park. You wish you were a Premiership champion, don't you? You know, say hello to your nanny at home. <laughs> you can't smile. You can't smile. You are holding the Premiership trophy after all. Why are you taking a photo now? I have taken a photo. I'm just holding, taking a video for you as well to show your nanny and stuff at home. Good size, isn't it? Yeah. It's actually the happiest one I thought of it. Oh, oh, look at that. Yep. The trophy that every player in this country aspires to win. Am I right? Mm hmm. Maybe one day Lewis will be in the Premiership. Hopefully. Maybe. There you go. <laughs> I think the guy who was actually standing beside us was a bit nervous. He was thinking we were going to drop the trophy and we actually weren't. Um, no, it was good. It was good to actually see the trophy. Our manager come over after I interviewed him and I goes, Do you want to hold it, Paul, for a bit of luck? Hopefully, get us promoted to the Premiership next season. You just give me this weird look. Hi, okay, well, you're dead on, mate. <laughs> um, no, but a great night last night in Lauren, so it was fun. It wasn't, many, it wasn't a big, massive crowd at the game last night. The highlights of the game um, will be available tomorrow on Welders TV. The behind the scenes footage is now available on Welders TV, and the interview that I conducted with the manager um, after the game is on Welders TV as well. Um, you go to YouTube and just say, search Welders. TV or Welders FC, whatever, and it'll come up there on the channel. You'll find it on there. If you're a football fan, please subscribe to it. I would appreciate the support because um, you get a load of stuff. There's going to be more stuff coming on the channel this year as well because I'll be doing a bit more stuff for the channel this year. Um, I'm maybe going back to the presenting days of the day, presenting days, sorry, where I used to stand in front of the camera every week and t talk about the news and tell about what's going on. and. We're going to be doing more videos behind the scenes like inside training, inside match day stuff with the players, more interviews, match highlights, just all the stuff that you do on a football channel. So if you're interested in all that, guys, please check out Welders TV. I would appreciate it if you subscribe to the channel. It doesn't cost you anything to do it. Just push subscribe. That's it. But anyway, I'm going to go now. Um, I was supposed to record a podcast today, guys, but I haven't had a chance to do it. I'm going to record it tomorrow. Now, tomorrow's a, a bit of an emotional day for me tomorrow. Um, tomorrow's actually my best friend who I've told you before in the podcast and also here on YouTube, 
my best friend who passed away a few years ago. It's his birthday tomorrow. So I'm having a few beers tonight. I'm hopefully hoping to maybe get, um, well, get a wee bit of a lie in tomorrow morning, maybe about 10 o'clock maybe at the most. Um, well, get the kids off, get the off to school first and then obviously go back to bed for an hour or two. Then I'm going to get up and I'm going to go to my friend's grave tomorrow. So he would have been 42 tomorrow, my friend. So um, I'm going to his grave tomorrow. So I am. So lay some flowers, tidy up as we, well, it's a tree, it's a memorial tree where his ashes was scattered. So I'm going to up tomorrow to clean up his tree and lay some flowers, spend a bit of time up there and stuff like that. So it's going to be an emotional day tomorrow. So I don't know why I'm going to be able to do a vlog tomorrow. Um, but if not, I will be on Saturday because I'm away on Saturday. I'm actually going to uh, Port Stewart, hopefully on Saturday. Fingers crossed for the day and maybe possibly Ballymena. Hmm. So stay tuned for that. Um, it'll probably just be like a montage video because I'm going to be spending time with people. And I really want to be sticking cameras on people's faces. So I'll just get montages of where I've been and stuff like that. And I'll show you it on the YouTube channel over the weekend. Um, no football this weekend. The boys are back to training on Saturday, but I'll not be there. Because I'm away for the weekend. I want to spend a bit of time to relax. A bit of me time. No kids. So, But the podcast will definitely be out tomorrow, Friday. Um, it's just today's been... Well, tomorrow will be a bit of an emotional day. So... I think the podcast will actually help me speak tomorrow and I'm obviously going to pay tribute to my friend tomorrow as well and I'm also going to be talking about what the hell is going on in this world tomorrow too. Some of the crazy stuff going on at the minute, especially the whole thing about the, the people down seeing the Titanic uh, boat, the whole stranded thing and big thing going on in Paris as well, big explosion in Paris and loads of our news to talk about plus i got loads of questions and Jackass of the Week is back tomorrow on the podcast too so... Stay tuned for that. Right, guys, I'm going to go. So if you enjoyed this video where we held, saw the Premiership Trophy in Lorne and it took Lewis to see if he still had a brain at the doctors. He still got a brain. And more. Drop a like this video, guys. New to the channel, please hit subscribe below. I would appreciate it. And thank you to everybody who came to me last night in Lorne again. I appreciate a lot of you come up to me and said you like the videos and you love the podcast and stuff. So you're legends, a lot of you. Thank you so much for your support. I appreciate it. Right, I'm off. Have a beer. Get this up and get, get a beer. <sighs> you see about 12 o'clock tonight I'll be getting on Moosey probably because it's going to be a sad day tomorrow oh, I do miss him but unfortunately it's life sucks at times so it does so right want to go in case you hear me with a lot of screaming inside uh, kids outside playing in pools and water it's a great day here in Northern Ireland it's beautiful sunshine everybody's out doing their garden and kids are out in swimming pools and everything it's brilliant the weather is beautiful I'm going to sit in the garden tonight with a cool beer we will just chill out and switch off in the world it's great <laughs> right, I want to get this t-shirt off as well do my head in right, till the next one guys see you all soon, thanks for watching